All right, everybody, today we are going to make some hay. So what you need to make hay, obviously, cut grass. Just so we have a wind road roll of grass here. Uh, we've got our mower, our big crow, as you can see, coming down this way. We've hired us a worker, and he is cutting our grass. So what we need to do is to ted the grass to turn it into hay. So let's go in down here at the shed right quick, and we'll find us a tractor. See here. Okay. There's our six R. We'll take the six R. We'll, uh, we're hooked to some eggs. All right. Egg production's coming along great, guys, with the coops we set up. There they are. As you can see, we're filling us a wagon. Let's drop this. Start a tractor up. Well, let's go find our tether. Should be around here somewhere. Oh, oh, there's Coke. Let's take Coke. Before we head up. Oh, take Coke. Wrong button. There we go. Where'd you go, Coke? There's Coke. Okay. Now well, let's go find our tether. We have purchased a tether already. Uh, I believe right now at this stage of the game, you have three tethers you can choose from. We've chosen, I think, a 8.4 meter tether. Help her see has completed their task. Oh, okay. Oh, gee, the one I couldn't see which one that wasn't fast enough. And help our F has a nearly full grain tank. Uh, we're harvesting our soybean fields, guys, and replanting. There's our tether. Let's get back over here to it. Back up. The crown. Okay. Let's go back over here. And what we'll do, we'll zoom out here and we'll drop our tether. We'll have it ready to go. Well, guys, once we ted this, we will need to wind roll it and next to where we got our tether at, over there, we have our chrome wind roller. Now let's drop this. And we'll turn it on. Okay. Just drive, guys. That's all you gotta do. As you can see, it's changing the color of the wind roll grass we have behind us. Turn it into hay. So we'll make a couple of passes of this. Uh, now guys, we are not going to bail our hay today. We're going to take our hay and see the hay lofts over there to the right behind our storage shed. We're just going to dump ours directly into that. Okay, let's run back into this row here. We'll shut the tether off. Oh, going a little too fast for the tether. Turn it back on. Let's head a few rows right quick. In ca side cab view here. Helper F has a full grain tank. We'll get to him in just a moment. Like I was telling you guys in the last video, the detail. Amazing. Watch the seat. You see the seat bouncing up and down. Air ride. That's right. Graphics in FS19 are amazing this year, guys. It's a great game. And I hope you're enjoying FS19. Uh, today is actually December the 26th. We are one day after Christmas. I hope the holidays are good for you and your family. So let's make one more swap through here. Because we got some other things we got to handle today. I just figured today, this early this morning, would be a great time to do a quick hay tutorial. Now, obviously, guys, if you wanted to bail this hay, all you have to do is go to your shop, buy either a round baler or a square baler, after you've wind rode this back up and went and uh, bail it, guys. But we're going to use a lot of this for uh, total mixed rations for our cows, so uh, we're going to just use the hay loft. <coughs> we can put it in. Excuse me there guys, we'll put it in uh, unbound 
and it will be mixed into our uh, total mixed rations mixer, our Stratman TMR mixer. And I said, well, no, let's just do this one right quick. Try to at least get a loading wagon full. And, uh, that's what we'll be picking it up with, guys. After we win road, we'll be picking it up with our loading wagon. We're also going to go ahead and do this because soon, very soon, we have our hay already. I mean, we're making hay. We have our straw. We have oats in the silos, and we will be buying a couple of horses here very shortly. So we're just getting everything ready for the horses. And uh, also, like I said, you can feed this hay to your sheep. It'll be just fine. The sheep will eat it. All right, let's fold the tanner up. And we'll raise our tanner. But uh, the horses, guys, is uh, something we're going to get into. We're, gonna, we're currently at a minus $300,000 deficit. And what that has come from, if you've noticed, I have accidentally paid back a big portion of our bank loan. But somehow it put us in the negative. So <clears throat> we're going to take the soybean harvest. And we have, uh, I've started making some silage, which we'll do a video here. Or probably our next video will be on silage. Uh, we will do a video on it, because I'm trying to pay back. <laughs> I mean, get out of the black air, so we can actually buy us an animal hauler to go purchase our horses. So let's unfold our crone. Let me show you right quick, guys, the options you have in store for tetters. Let's see here. Tetters. Well, actually, you got three options. You have a 6 meter, a 8.7 meter, which is the one we have. And you have your Potzinger, which is a 13 meter tetter. And then for wind rollers, you have five options. You have a 4.6 meter, a, looks like a 8.5 meter. A 9.3, a 14.8, and then a 9.1. We're using the 9.1 meter, the Coon, which is a row merger, which allows us to shoot it off to the left, to the right, or down the center. And that's why I've picked this one. I mean, it's uh, a lot more you can do. You can run them to one side and then come back and run it up the other side and then merge both rows together, uh, which is handy. But we just went ahead and bought this one. So let's lower. Let's set our merge. Let's see here. Oh, I set my merger. Where are we at here? See, it's set to merge left. We don't want that. Let's see here. Let's see how, maybe we need to lift it first. Oh, we don't want to fold it, we want to lift. Let's no, unmap. There we go. Uh, with it raised, guys, you're going to use R1 and L3. There we go, we want to put it in the middle. Now let's lower, and we should be ready to go. Turn on the merger. Let's merge. We'll zoom out here. See? Nice wind road rolls, guys. The merger. Which I like the merger. But now obviously if we were spraying uh, or swath or swathing, let's say that, with our crone big M, if we were uh, actually leaving a huge swath, obviously you'd want a bigger wind roller because you would bring more of an area into one row and therefore you know uh, getting it done quicker but now what we're just doing like I said we're just using a little merger because uh, we're leaving it swathed in one row into a smaller row in the middle when our coon mows over when we come back run a tanner right quick 
nothing fancy guys I mean it's nothing hard nothing no rocket science here so we will go ahead and merge roll these real quick and then we will do a pickup and dump over in the hayloft There you seen as we passed there was our horse pasture. We are going to put some horses in that guys and said we'll do a video on how to take care of and maintain horses, nothing major. Stop with this row here. Alright. Over we'll here to our 8R, which has our loading wagon. Start her up. Lower the pickup head. Just a little there. It won't we'll load. As of now, this is the biggest capacity loaded wagon you can get in game, guys. Uh, it hasn't. We bought the extension for the wagon. So oh, let's get back over here. Watch that cab rock. Beautiful guys graphics. I told you are amazing. Our John Deere 8 R here. We're almost well, we're halfway full guys already. Let's see. Make a turn here. We'll come back down this road. Back in our cab. Pick up the rest of this here. So I think this tank holds 56,500 liters. You see, we're approaching that very quickly. And the reason we've done that so quickly, guys, I mean, you're, the roll that we just uh, tatted and picked up, the roll that was here to our left, uh, was a double roll, actually. Uh, we'd already mowed that once and let it set. The branch grew back. We mowed right over the same spot again, and it swathed right back over that, guys, and made a big roll. So, uh, basically, double roll is what I call them, super rolls. Uh, so, that's why that loading wagon filled up so quick on that first roll, but didn't finish filling up that quick on the roll we just did, and on this roll. These are single past mow rolls. They've been mowed one time and wind row. Uh, like I said, that first roll had been... I think it was two times it had been mowed and just left lay there. So we are full. A little cut across here behind the cow pasture. Like I said, guys, beautiful cow pasture. I'm really loving the layout of the ranch here, guys. Uh, so what we will do is come over here to our hay lofts. Now the first loft here, as you see we're coming up to, is straw slat all full it's completely full guys 250,000 liters these buildings hold and this one is full of straw so we'll go on to our second one like right, said guys just get in this little loading area there you go you're in it and we'll unload our hay now push the throttle up throttle up as it unloads awesome now, here we go we're just dumping in there's our hay coming out guys now these uh, hay lofts will only hold straw or hay. They will not hold grass. They will not hold silage. Uh, 
over here is our BGA which we own to make uh, you can make silage on your own farms guys if you buy let's go here silos let's go to bunkers you can buy silo bunkers silage bunkers but we went ahead and bought the BGA which has two bunkers in it you see right there and here you see we've dumped and leveled out one row and here's another one we just dropped we'll have to level out but we'll cover that guys and ferment it into silage so uh that's it guys on the hay you've we've made hay very simple like i said cut your grass uh, you can cut your grass with we have a vehicle mower which is the chrome big m450 like I said, you start a nice small scale, guys. I mean, you do not have to have the crone. I mean, you can do hay simply. Let's go up here to mowers. You can buy the New Holland, which is a very cheap, affordable mower. Mows a uh, four meter swath. You got the crone. You got your pot singer. Now, these two, the pot singers, you can hook together on the front of your tractor, actually. You can combine them into one piece. As you see, they got a puzzle piece down here. And it shows you it will connect with the X, it looks like the XBED, or the X8, the X8ED. There you go, there's what it is. Those will connect together. Now, here are the Lily. They will, uh, show the puzzle piece, they connect together too, or they will work together. But you can mow with that, guys. Just cut your grass, and then Ted, windrow. You have hay. And then if you want to bail, go into bailing technology. Bailing technology, right there. New Holland round baler, forty-nine thousand uh, dollars. Right there is a round baler and wrapper. No, 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 that's the square baler. There's the round baler and wrapper, all in one, to make silage instantly. So, and there's just more technology for baling, guys. Like I said, straw, hay, grass. We just chose to pick ours up and place it in a hayloft directly. So. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, like I said, we'll be doing a video here shortly on horses. Now that we have hay, we have straw, we have oats. We'll get us uh, some animal transport, and we will buy some horse. Thanks for watching.